This is Max Williams with United Real Estate, and today I'm in North Richmond. Today we're going to look at a three-bedroom, two-full-bath ranch-style home. This home is located here in a real quaint block. We've got some other well-maintained homes here. A really quiet street here in the city. Uh, on the other side of the street, we've got a lot of brick ranch-style homes. This home is closing today and uh, so it's not available however I wanted to bring it to you uh, a couple things I wanted to share with you about the situation my buyer had another home to sell uh, we sold that home uh, about a week or so ago uh, for more than asking price and sold it quickly we had multiple buyers and logistically we have to think about this process in order to make it as smooth as possible when you have a home to sell and then you need those funds to immediately turn around and buy another home. Uh, we commonly do what is called a sale lease back in that scenario. And basically what that means is we tell the new purchaser of the home that you're selling that, hey, uh, we are happy to sell this home to you, but we need to rent it back from you for a period of, of, of a few days. And that gives the seller the ability to go ahead, get their funds, and then transition and buy the new home and not be homeless in the process. So we were able to work that out. Uh, it's important to think about these things well in advance so that you can structure your sale accordingly. And that's another good reason. It's a good idea to work with an experienced agent that can help you kind of think through some of these logistics. Uh, this home was actually done by a rehabber that I know personally. Uh, we actually videoed one of his other properties that's under construction not too far from here. Uh, no matter how big Richmond seems to feel, it's funny because from a real estate standpoint, we end up seeing and doing business with a lot of the same people over and over again. Uh, that's particularly good because over time you get to build trust and rapport with people in the industry. So who would you rather do business with? Someone that you know and trust or someone that you have no idea who they are, whether they're ethical or even know what they're doing. So I really value those relationships that I've been able to build over time here locally. Okay, did a great, great job on this home. As you can see, we've got all new finishes throughout. We've got new carpet, new paint. Uh, the kitchen is new. Uh, he just did an amazing job on this home. Uh, we're leaving bedroom number one. We've got bedroom number two here. This is going to be the middle size bedroom. Uh, a lot of these bedrooms do have ceiling fans in them. And one of the ceiling fans I'm going to point out to you in the dining room is kind of high tech. Um, it, it's funny because the rehabber, you could tell, uh, was kind of a, a nerdy guy when it came to buying some of these neat little touches. Uh, one of those touches I'm going to point out to you here in the bathroom it's not that massive shower unit that we've seen previously in some of the homes but it's right here a much simpler design with this medicine cabinet notice we've got the illuminated button there and we hit it boom it completely illuminates that medicine cabinet just a really really neat touch if you've got to apply makeup you've got good even lighting there nice soft lighting and uh, that's a nice, nice touch. Okay, we're gonna transition now here to our left. This is going to be our master bedroom. This is not as old of a house as many in the neighborhood. And as a result, when they put in this master, they not only gave us a walk-in closet, but they also gave us an ensuite bathroom. So very unusual in this area to be able to get a ranch style home with those amenities. Here is our ensuite right here. Uh, we've got, once again, detachable shower head. I like what he did there. And he continued on in here uh, with a black granite here for our vanity. And that's a, a, like a kind of a mahogany or cherry wood, once again, with that modern uh, medicine cabinet and vanity light overhead. Okay, we're now going to transition into my absolute favorite room in this house, and it is the kitchen. He did a great, great job in transforming this kitchen. Uh, we've got a nice open floor plan here in the kitchen. 
We're open to our informal dining area and there's just a lot of space to work with. This is a uh, vinyl plank material on the floor. I think it works really, really nicely with this granite. Notice here, we've got the overhang for probably four short bar stools, but they took the granite all the way down here to the floor. I think that's just a really classy look here uh, on this countertop. Uh, we do have the white cabinetry, uh, stainless steel appliances. We've got the commercial look here for the faucet, the double bowl sink. Uh, I think they just did an amazing job with this rehab. Uh, double door refrigerator there with ice maker. And then we've got a nice big, big laundry room here. Your washer dryer would go right there in the middle of the frame. We've got storage overhead and there is an electric water heater. That's a large electric water heater for this home. So she's never gonna run out of hot water here in this home. Of course, it is modern 200 amp electrical and we do have a nice deck here in the back. I wanna show you this because it's a great place to entertain. You've got good space back here and the storage building it does have electricity. There's actually a concrete floor in that storage building. So it's not some little rinky dink uh, building that you would um, get from one of the big box stores. That is actual true construction. Uh, the home does have a dimensional roof for good durability and vinyl siding. All right, that's gonna do it for this beauty. Uh, remember, it's 2020, almost 2020. If you have home ownership on your radar and you want to make that move, start early, give me a call. We'll put you in touch with the right people and it gets you some grant money, 100% financing. Any and everything you qualify will do for you in order to get the best deal possible. Max Williams, 804-402-7788. Be sure to comment, like, and subscribe if you would be so kind. Thanks so, so much for taking the tour. Have a great day.